And remember, Alabama Kent State is an early kickoff on Saturday morning at 11 a.m. Crimson Tide kickoff moves up an hour to 10 a.m. right here on WVUA 23. Well, Deontay Wilder has brought boxing to new heights in Tuscaloosa and the state of Alabama, but long before the Bronze Bomber brought home the heavyweight championship to T-Town, Mike Hutchinson, better known as the Tuscaloosa Kid, made a name for himself in the professional ranks as a championship contender. Boxing has attracted considerable fanfare in Tuscaloosa since Deontay Wilder became the WBC heavyweight champion in 2015. Nevertheless, enthusiasts yearning for a glance of local boxing's early history can visit Charlie's Gym just off Greensboro Avenue. Established in 1978, the gym was built by and served as the training arena for boxing legend Mike Hutchinson, known locally and within the professional boxing realm as the Tuscaloosa Kid. Hutchison began his training at age 12 in 1971 under his father, Charlie, who also trained then amateur boxer Edgar Mad Dog Ross in a ring in Ross's backyard. Hutchison's childhood dream was centered on fighting professionally. His nickname emerged when he joined Ross at a training camp in Orlando, Florida during the late 1970s, and he encountered heavyweight professional boxer Jody Ballard, who couldn't remember Hutchison's name, but knew he was a kid from Tuscaloosa. Totally in his final record at 23-3, Hutchison fought professionally within the welterweight division during the 1980s until his first retirement in 1986 due to damage to his eye. He returned to the ring one last time over a decade later and achieved a comeback victory in 1998. Today, the 57-year-old Hutchison relives his experiences through fond recollections. It seemed like everything happened just yesterday. Uh, I can remember when I was 12 years old getting started, and I remember when I uh, fighting in the Golden Gloves in the Southern and uh, turning pro. Uh, you know, I think about the time a lot. Following his father's tradition, 29-year-old Point Hutchison engaged in a brief professional boxing career of his own around 2009, earning a professional record of 2-1. and one. You know, it was pretty cool growing up with a dad for a boxer and giving us that opportunity to do it and experience because there's nothing, there's no better feeling than being in a ring with all eyes on you in one-on-one -on -one sport and having the referee raise your hand. Talk to longtime fight fans here in West Alabama. They remember the Tuscaloosa Kid. Our thanks to Keith Huffman from WVUA for researching and shooting that piece. All right, we're back with more news after this.